This is Passport to Texas. As marine predators go, sharks swim at the top of the food chain. Without having these top-end apex predators, you have the ecosystem that gets out of balance. These predators help control everything below them. But they can't control what's below them if they're gone. Worldwide, sharks have been depleted by overfishing. Between 30 and 70 million sharks killed by humans every year. One of the things that has contributed to a decline in sharks was shark finning. Fishermen who actually catch the sharks and cut their fins off and discard the body. Illegal in American waters since 1993, finning remains active in foreign waters as fishermen earn up to $900 a pound for the fins. Illegal fishing on gear called long lines occurs close to home, too. It's the most immediate threat to sharks in the U.S., says Game Warden Sergeant Luis Sosa. We've got Mexican commercial fishermen that come into U.S. waters, Texas waters on a daily basis. Unfortunately, the most common type of species that is being caught on this illegal gear are sharks. The Wildlife and Sport Fish Restoration Program supports our series. For Texas Parks and Wildlife, I'm Cecilia Nasty.